And the first boat has arrived at the launch site. And we're not there yet. Partet ons moet alweer draf. There goes Salty Dutch. Yo, look at that tractor flying. Weisman got them on the plane. Well done. Don't know what boat that is. Probably a 17.6 Yelp cat. I see they still build them new small. Waited that one out over it. He's running for the mid break. Hey, that's the ugly one. Is he going to get in front of it? No, he got over it in time. Well done, salty nuts. Happy hunting. Enjoy the day. Hey, that climax being pushed. The Wiseman brings him with the speed. Because he's got some lip to get him over. Both 200s have started. And that boat has got all the electronics that Yamaha can throw at it. It's got all the best equipment Yamaha can put on a vessel it can stand still on one spot it can anchor itself with those fly-by-wire 200 Yamaha four strokes beautiful vessel Johan Lange the skipper this morning Power. So running for the mid break, he's gonna get one or two to bump. That's gonna be a nice. No, he turned shy of it. Gave us a little bit of a nose up there. Well done, climax. Boring, but well done. Happy hunting. Enjoy the day. Oh, it's watermark that's being pushed. Sorry. Stand up in such a straight line, I can't see who's who in the zoo. Wiseman put him in deep. That's going to be it. Oh, he gets away from the shore dump. Watermark is floating nicely. Yo, there's some ugly ones standing up in the mid break now. But they are far and in between. Waterbark is turning east. Is he going to turn around? No, he's just going to work his way through that saddle. He's coming down south. It's giving him a hard time. He yeah, will have to turn around, eh? Hey? Yeah. Nasty one on his bum there. And he's hitting sand, so he's gonna have to take it on the shoulder. The Alcat is built for this type of launches, so that's not a problem for the Alcat. Nicely done, Mark. Did something get used there? What's happened to the co-pilot? <laughs> That's going to be a splash over! Nope, he got the nice nose, nice and light, nose nice and light there. Looks like if Mark has got the problem starting the one motor. 
That's what the co-pilot did. He went to do some priming. Still just look like one motor running there. Nice flyby from the seagulls. You've got two motors going, that is going to be a nice big one. Yo! Can't figure out if he's got one or two motors going there. Looks, looks like two. It's now right in front of the mid brake. There is a flat that he can push through. Why do I think that boat is powered by one motor only? Yep, one motor only power. That's a launch. Hope you guys got the problem sorted soon. All the best. Look guys, the next one. Two one one five Yamaha's. So you say thank you. It's a nice and early float. Jalukas coming north. That's an ugly one to push him. Okay, dissipated, he gets over it, that is what the Hellcats are for, is this short dump, Yo, he turns around quickly in front of that one, making sure that he's got power, watermark is back on two motors in the distance over there, I can see both motors as they're running now. One one five pushing that the old cat nicely. It's a lucky dear my car if you get caught by the shore dump. And there's a nice mid break here in the channel as well. If you look us on the power, he found his angle, he's running for the gap. Yeah, he's gonna make it nice and smooth. Well done Jaluka, happy hunting, enjoy the day. Eventually it's Maverick's turn to 154 strokes has started on the 8.3 meter Batcat. Josh is the skipper. Kaylin is the deckhand. Dylan is the deckhand. Floating nicely here in the channel. He's gonna get on the power, yes. Hopefully one nasty one pushing him on the shoulder, he's gonna get in front of it, he's gonna shy of that one it's closing up on him he's got over it sideways another one sideways well done Josh just give you guys an idea of what the size of the break is anyway happy hunting enjoy the day okay monster's not doing his traditional walk but his transducer is down so he's well prepared for the surf conditions here today Got all the skippers a little bit on the edge of their seats. Uncle Frankie is coming back. So we're gonna have a nice early breakfast today. And Wiseman is pushing. 104 strokes Suzuki's on the back 
21 foot. We get nice light, nice light vessel for one man operation here in St. Lucia. Mons is a charter operation and he's also got holiday accommodation if you guys are interested in a package deal. Contact Mons on Asterix Charters. You can ask me for the contact details if you can't find it. I'll gladly give it to you. I'm pushing hard for the mid break. Keeps on closing on his shoulder, but he's going to turn into it. Might give us a little bit of a flying asterisk. Oh, look at that ugly one standing on his shoulder. Yo, but he's well in front of it. But the sketch, the brake is catching up to him. Yup, we got over at the time. Well done, Mons. Happy hunting. Enjoy the day. And that is wave dancer being pushed. Wiseman is approaching this situation very calmly. And he's picking up speed. And he landed him nice and deep. I didn't concentrate there because somebody is blowing whistles. I can't figure out why. Warren is on wave dancer today. Still got Leon's video to edit from yesterday with all the footage they sent me. Orange on the power. It's going to run for the mid break with that 9.3 meter butt cat. Jeez. <laughs> Look at that experience. Yeah, I don't know. I don't need to polish his ego. His ego is shiny. His experience is shining enough. Three Spirit One on the fly. The World Research Team. They're gathering value and information regarding the whales and the population of the whales. And the health of the population, oops, by ge getting their DNA data. That was a sudden zoom, but it will show the people more how big the waves are. If I zoom out a lot, the people can't see how big the waves is. That's Free Spirit 1, 8.3 meter carry cat, charter operation here in St. Lucia with 204 stroke Suzuki's on the back. Walter Leibram, the owner and the skipper. It's running a little bit north, turning into the gully, up and over that one. Midbreak is forming bad, bad on the sandbank. But it opens up gaps and it stays open for quite a bit. He's going to jump that foamy. It's not a big deal. He's turning on the sandbank. He's got right through that one. Over that one. Well done, Walter. Experience shows with the... The uncles today. Happy hunting. Enjoy the day. Happy whaling. Enjoy the day. Conscious Charter 1 being pushed. Only the one whale watching trip for today.
always a little bit than a bad one there. Yo, that makes your tummy turn. He got through it nicely. Checking that everybody is still on board. Nine meter Bencat with two 250 V64 strokes on the back. Little bit of difficult launches here today, although the waves doesn't seem that big. It's still tricky. Some five footers washing through over the sandbank with a lot of sand in there. In the cool, it means it's shallow on the sandbank. Captain Sean Mansfield. It's on the power. They're running for mid break. It's got a beautiful gap to run through. Well done, Sean. Happy whale watching. Enjoy the trip. <laughs> 